Hi, I'm Derek Herr with Evolution Wheel, and today we're talking about telehandler stability and specifically how the weight of your tire affects the stability of the overall machine. Okay, so telehandler stability is important. Why is it important? Well, the load chart in the cab is important. And you want to know when you're lifting at a certain reach, distance, weight, that that load chart is accurate. When an OEM is designing and building a machine, uh, weight distribution is very important. So you can look in the back, you see a counterbalance weight, you see a heavy frame, you've got tires, rims, axles, cab, chassis. The whole machine is balanced and counterbalanced so that the load chart is accurate. They make sure that there's even weight distribution on the back uh, to counterbalance the load that you're lifting on the front and making sure that the stability triangle is intact. Now, OEMs are using 850 pounds as a design spec weight for a tire and rim. That represents a rim on a foam-filled pneumatic. Roughly, it's about 850 pounds. And so at Evolution Wheel, when we designed our tire, we made sure that we hit 850 pounds so that we weren't changing the load stability chart in the cab, either positively or negatively. You wanna hit that same weight so that the stability on your machine is the same as what the load chart is spec for very important if you're changing tires from factory to an aftermarket option. Okay, so we're talking about a properly weighted tire for the machine, making sure that you're in that 850 pound spec range on your tire and rim. So we thought, well, let's do a good test so that we can show exactly what we're talking about and, and the relationship between the low chart and the properly weighted ballast on the machine. Uh, we've got our tires mounted on all four corners. Um, we've got a 6,800 pound load on the front. That's a full tote of water. And then below it is a full uh, pallet of basically steel plates. Um, and based on the load chart in the machine, 6,800 pounds, we should be tipping in around the C range. Uh, so what we're gonna do, we've got the boom at zero degree angle. We're just gonna go straight out with the boom and we're gonna wait and see when the uh, rear tires of the machine start to tip up off the ground. Uh, if we're properly weighted, the tires should be coming off at around the end or C range. Okay, so as we discussed, the load chart in your machine and the stability triangle relationship is important to maintain and keep intact. Just make sure if you're replacing tires in your machine that you're not affecting that load chart and your stability triangle. I'm Derek Herr with Evolution Wheel. If you have any questions, just give us a call. We're always here to help.